early on, I didn't get to see much of that. But then, you know, once I, I started playing uh, through the season with him in that first year, year I, I realized that he was actually a very funny guy. Every now and then he would let his guard down and, and you know, and, and and mess around with the guys and stuff like that. Um, I remember the first day I met him, I said hi to him, and he didn't say hi to me, and he just walked right by, and I'm thinking to myself, why is he not saying hi to me? So I went into the clubhouse. I said to the guys, I said, is he a jerk? Why is he not saying hi? He goes, don't talk to him. He's pitching today. So I was like, really? So then after the after the start, I, I, I had talked to him, and he goes, I'm so sorry. I didn't even recognize you on my days that I pitch. I am so locked in and so focused on what I have to do. So it took a little while for him and I to develop that where he would kind of let his guard down and uh, be a jokester and, and stuff like that. But it was fun to see. He was, he was, he, at times when he wasn't pitching, he could be very lighthearted. He always liked, uh, you know, pulling plank, pranks on guys. And it was nice to see, that even though he was this ultra um, focused guy that was so determined to to uh, pitch his best, he was able to have fun with the guys too, and he became one of my my favorite teammates uh, on the team. Did you ever get in on any of these pranks with him, or maybe you were one he was pulling a prank against that you can remember right now? No, you know, being a veteran uh, when Roy was there, I didn't ever have to uh i didn't fall victim to his pranks usually it was on the rookies and the younger guys um i I remember in spring training uh one of the young guys messed with roy and uh and him and aj did this whole um this whole wedding ceremony i don't know if you guys heard about it was uh, it aaron hill yes yes it was aaron hill and russ adams yeah and uh it was, I mean, it must have cost him thousands and thousands of dollars. He had a blimp uh, overhead in spring training that had this, this message, uh, you, know, uh, you know, following behind it. It was, he brought in a whole uh, a wedding company to set up the whole thing. So, it, it, you know, it, it's a long story, but it, it, was, uh, it was hilarious. And luckily, uh, you know, I didn't fall victim to any of his pranks.